Hey everybody, I wanted to jump on and do a little, I guess, share with you guys. I received some happy mail. Um, I placed some orders and received a few of those the past few days. Um, I'm going to start with the Tim Holtz new ink pads. And this is the Distress Oxidi, uh ink pads. I have not played with these guys. Um, I ordered these off of Scrapbook. There's 12 sets. Uh, I ordered off of scrapbook.com and it was a bundle for $60. I hear that you can get them cheaper and I don't remember the website but one of my friends on Instagram said that she um, knows a website that you can get them for like $48. Um, if I had known that I probably would have jumped on that. Um, either way I'm happy I got them. I thought it was still a decent price and eventually, because I'm a huge Tim Holtz Distressed Ink fan, I love his ink. Um, I would probably want them all anyway, so I figured this was the best way to go. Um, and I think it's all the same colors as the, you know, the regular Distress pads. Um, there's much more that you can do with these that you can't do with his other ink or any other ink um, that is out there. Uh, and I think this when you activate it with or spray it with water it has more of a chalky look and I think feel to it but it doesn't like flake off on your finger like chalk would um, yeah so there's I still have to play with these I'll do a tutorial and give you guys you know my thoughts on these when I open them up and start playing with them but I still have uh, a lot to learn with these but I was happy to get those today so I got those. Um, if you have not played with the, the Distress Ink, they're so much pretty. Uh, they're so much fun and very pretty. Um, I love his inks. And then it's my first time buying the. Let me show you guys. The Nouveau. Um, and these are the Crystal Drops. And I cannot tell you the. Uh, the color of these, I'm not sure why they didn't put it on the bottle, but I cannot find it anywhere in the bottle, um, the colors. So these are the crystal uh, drops. They also have the glitter drops. They have the jewel drops. Um, I got four just to, you know, to see if I'd like them, and so far I haven't really played with them, um, but I'm loving uh, the colors, and I did... Uh, do a few little drops just to share with you guys how nice and round uh, compared to the liquid pearls I love this with the liquid pearls I can never get like a really nice round shape to it it always had like that little Hershey kiss um, tip to it but these um, I mean they seem really you know easy to play with uh, the only thing that I have to check up on and this one is the it's a clear, what does it say, clear? Um, crystal drop. And this, it kind of dissolved the black ink um, in the little white uh, drop, which I'm not understanding why, or I don't know, even know if it's supposed to do that, but I'm going to have to double look and see if it does. I did it on white paper, and it didn't, obviously, didn't change any color. And it kind of looks like a deep blue when it's supposed to be clear. And I did it on the purple. Let me see. And you can pull them off, too. There's so little. No, see, now it, yeah, there is a little purple in there, too. I don't know if you guys can see that. My nails broke. Don't mind my nails, guys. So it fell. Um, I don't know if it's supposed to do that or not on colored paper, but it is sucking out the, the color from the paper. Uh, so, I mean, they're so shiny and so, like, just perfect. Uh, once I start really playing with them, guys, uh, with these, you can, I think that you can paint with them, you can, uh, embellish with them, um, you can make enable dots with them, uh, yeah, so... And not only that, the packaging is like super cute. I went back on scrapbook.com. These are $277. Um, 
on scrapbook.com. So I went back and ordered, I, I don't know, 20, I think, of them. I, I ordered a bunch of them. Not only the crystal drops, but I got some of the um, glitter dots. And they also have glow dots. And I think they glow in the dark. I um, ordered a few of those, too, just to kind of play with. Um, but, yeah, I just wanted to share those with you guys. My first time purchasing this brand. Um, so I don't think they're anything new. They're just coming out with new colors. And when I get the rest, I'll share those with you guys. So far, like I said, I'm loving that it doesn't lose its shape and it doesn't have like that tip, um, to it. And you can peel these right off and, um, use them on your crafts. So yeah, I ordered a few of those. Um, what else? Simon says I ordered, uh, three things off of that site and of course I went back on the other day to order a few more things yes I'm going crazy um I got the La La Land uh crafts the still um coffee cup die I am absolutely loving everything about this die guys I cut some out too um if you're on my Instagram you probably had already seen it but it's like the perfect size. I love the the design in it. It's kind of like a maybe a stitch, if you want to call. Um, let me show you guys. Look how cute that little coffee cup is. It's like perfect for the crafts that I do. I just think it's so pretty. So, it is a little pricey. I paid twenty bucks for it, but I'm gonna get a lot of use out of that. So I ordered that one, and I ordered this one, guys. What, where do you, does this look familiar? As soon as I seen this, I was like, it's the same exact coffee cup from the Doodle Bug collection. Um, what is it? Cream and sugar. And it, you guys can see it exactly the same die. I think this one was $8 and some change. Um, I cannot wait to play with this. Make it look so cute. But I'm not sure if it goes with that collection i think this was um a simon's um simon says uh die but too cute so i ordered it and i'm gonna make it look even cuter and then i ordered this one by penny black and once i've seen i actually seen this on another site i don't remember where and i wanted it so bad and i couldn't figure out where in the hell i seen it so when i seen it on simon said's uh website i snatched that right up I thought she was so cute, so I did get that. Um, I got a stamp I ordered off of eBay. La La Land Craft, and this is Cupcake Princess Marcy. What does it say? It's a tea and cupcake kind of day. She has a cup of tea and a little cupcake. I thought she was the cutest, and she's a really nice size, too. Let me show you. Now, I'm going to show you my card, guys. I did share it on my Instagram. And if you watch me, I've been buying the Spectrum Noir markers, alcohol markers. And I've been doing, you know, practicing as much as I can um, with those damn markers and trying to blend well. It, it just ain't happening. So please do not mind my coloring. I know it is way, way off. But isn't she a cute stamp? So I made like a little tea time, I guess, uh, card and I embossed it with the Tim Holtz, um, embossing folder, little coffee cups. So yeah, I think she's really pretty. And I, that is that. And then I ordered again, uh, these damn orders. Let me show you these tags. This is that coffee cup. And this is a little uh, teddy bear I ordered off of eBay a while back ago. Well, not too long ago. I think it was like 99 cents with free shipping. Um, I just felt the need to add him with a little coffee cup and a tag. And this is just a tag die that I have. So I feel like I need to add coffee or just something to it. It's not finished. And then I did this one and I used my mini coffee die um, on this one, and I used the Starbucks little logo, and that fit like so perfect around that little die cut for the front. So I put the little Starbucks logo. I just um, used some foam tape to, 
you know, give that some dimension. I used two tags. Thought that was cute. A little steam. That's another uh, die out of one of my coffee themed die sets. So those are some tags. I ordered again off of Coffee Planners and Sunshine. She's on Instagram. You can check her out. She has her website on her Instagram. Uh, everything always sticks to every damn thing. Um, she has these really cute, let me turn it over, I was kind of in backwards, these really cute uh, Starbucks stamps, and I think these are $7 and some change, and it has like that acrylic block, and then there's the little rubber stamp, the ink that I used kind of stained it, but that's okay, I'll most likely use brown or green on those but I thought that it was a really cute stamp especially for I'm not a coffee lover I just love the whole look um, of the coffee cup and you know but I'll have some fun with that and then so you, are you already seen this uh, is one of her newer washi sets and she also has the let me see the frappy this one I just ordered I hope you guys can see that Really cute coffee or Starbucks washi. I ordered these little bunnies. I'm not sure if you can see them. They're, they look kind of like adult bunnies all dressed up. I ordered two of those because these were so cute. Let me see if I can kind of roll it out for you guys so you can get a better look. I'm always unrolling washi, guys. I have to see it unrolled. There we go. Let's see if you guys can see that. Kind of holding a little purse. That is so cute. And she had, I don't know if she still does. Um, I ordered two sets of them, little bunny uh, stickers that would go so well with this. I'll fix that later. So I got those. And I'm not sure if I shared this one. This is a wider Starbuck coffee. She's coming out with new Starbucks stickers too. I think they're a little bit more uh, colorful. Probably most likely uh, the style of these cups. So I got that. And then I got the perfume washi set. She has the stickers and the washi for $9 and some change. Um, so I ordered it. Said I love the perfume washi. Where's my damn sticker? They're somewhere around here. I just had them. Right in front of me. And of course I can't find them. Right here. Yep. So this is a set that she has. And they're nice size stickers too. So those are all the styles. I'm going to open them up. Because they're too cute. And again, they're like a perfect size too. So, And I don't think she sells these individually. I think she only has them with the set. I'm going to have a lot of fun with these. And then she just added these. I think for like an extra goodie. These... A little doll or girly uh, stickers. Those are really cute. I know they don't. I don't think they come in a set. Just all different style um, perfume bottles. This one is really pretty with the floral. So you know I can't wait to play with those. And then one with the bow. Love them. So, I think that is it as far as that. And then she had, um, and I think she's out of stock on those washies too. Um, those washies sell so fast, especially the Starbucks uh, washi. She has some really pretty things coming to her site too. So, if you go check her out, guys, just kind of give her a heads up that I sent you over there. Maybe I'll get, you know, a little discount on my next purchase or something that always helps. Um... And then these wide uh, Starbucks washies. You get the like coffee cup. I think there's cupcakes in there. Little coffee beans. So she only had two left. And I said, you know what, I'll take the last two. Um, when I make flip books or pocket letters, I have a lot of ladies that, you know, love their coffee. I'll uh, get some good use in those Starbucks um, washies. So I got that. What else do I want to share with you guys? I think that is it. Like I said, I'm waiting on a few more orders, and uh, 
second damn candle. This candle, guys, from the Dollar Tree, those new ones in the tin, they smell so good, especially that uh, brown um, colored one. Kind of reminds me of fallish, yeah. All right, I think that is it, guys. I am going to uh, see these are so perfect to me. They're already, and they dry pretty fast, too. It don't take forever to dry. I wonder if you can kind of make your own colors, too. I don't know. All right, I'm rambling on now. I'm going to make me a nice hot cup of tea. I'm going to pull out some of my um, projects that I'm in the middle of doing or some that I had completed, and I'm going to do a project share video tonight. So I know a lot of you ladies have been waiting on this video, so make sure you come back by, and uh, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.